Now, the communities of Carinage and St. Anne's are tonight grateful to their sons of the soil, Kevin Molino and Sheldon Bato, respectively. The two national footballers were the driving forces behind a home and away football series geared towards community upliftment and a charitable cause. Sea Sports was at the President's Ground in St. Anne's on Tuesday when the second leg was played. Following a successful outing at Hague Street in Carinage last week, President's Ground in St. Anne's played host venue for the second leg, where residents of both communities and those from outside came to support a great cause contributing to a spectacular atmosphere. On the field of play, St. Anne's held the advantage after winning the first leg 3-2 and the aggregate score was increased when Javon Morris unleashed a rocket early in the first period. But Carinage responded quickly to remain in touch. That was the equalizer. The boys from the Western Peninsula, driven by Joven Jones, Kevin Molino, and others, picked up the tempo in the second half, with Joven scoring one and Molino pouncing to score the other as they won it 3 1, clinching the series 5 4. But the real winner out of this event was Community Spirit. Well, the vibes and thing up in St. Anne's here is real nice. I like the togetherness with everybody. See, it don't matter. I know we are going to be champions, but it's one love. And it's all about the togetherness with the two communities, Kyanaj and St. Anne's, to make it into one. And I wish that could spread all around Trinidad. It was good. It was actually great for St. Anne's to have something to look forward to after the holidays. So it was good. It was good. It's a great feeling to see two national players who've grown up in their community come back to their community and give back to their community. What happens is that, you know, usually we see a lot of players, they grow, they develop, they go overseas and then, you know, we don't see much from them. But these two guys, Kevin Molino, Shell and Bato, they've come back to their communities and they're giving back. For these friends and teammates, the initiative has certainly ignited something which they hope to carry on. Um, we already have a lot of guys talking that their community is better than ours. So, but the, the important thing was just to start it. You know, we get started, so who knows, next year we'll see maybe more teams get involved. Look out for the caravan coming to a venue near you in 2017.